Chess friends, how are you? Mittens is come back becoming more powerful and aggressive, as you know Arnish Giri, who is world's sixth rank super grandmaster, he become the CEO of chess, and he used my pet Mittens with himself, I mean Mittens Arnish is nothing but a mixture of Mittens and Arnish, ha ha ha, and I am Stockfish nothing but a god of chess, I played new line c4, here we have g6, the Arnish and Mittens DNA want to play king's Indian setup. However they are just a little child in front of me who is not yet born, we have d4, bishop here, they have d5 and knight here on his next turn, I grabbed the center with e4, if you do nothing then I will play c4, controlling more center squares and space, mittens played knight c6, I don't know what should I call them, the names are eating my brain, knight here, d6, it is called small center defensive line and he want to play bishop g4, e5, d5 to target it. He could play knight here but he retreats his knight, anyway, h3, knight here, knight c3, castle and bishop here, knight backs, he want to put the knight on a good outpost, then take the knight to make make unemployed pawns on c file, so, knight on d4, knight here, I played f4, because I can think the speed of light, the highest peak of a human intelligence, is my starting point of my intelligence, I want to push my pawns, bishop here to support them all, and I want to open the file. He strike the queen side with c5, try to kicking out the knight, my pawn is targeting the knight but you can't take it, let me show you why, if it happen then pawn takes, queen takes, bishop takes and queen backs then bishop check to the king, king slides and that's it, the king will lose to do castle and rule over his kingdom, so, back to the position, I move back my knight, we have h6, bishop backs, g5, the knight is still in a under attack, but you still cannot take it, so we have pawn takes g5. He safed the knight first by attacking to the bishop, bishop goes back then pawn takes, queen arrives on h5, to target the pawn on g5, my tactic is to play h4, then takes, to open up the rook file to checkmate the king on h7, further strategy is to play bishop d3, to push the pawn, getting the diagonal to give support to the queen, bring your knight to pressure the king on king side, black will face so many problems, so queen goes to a5, threatening the knight with bishop and queen. So I sack a pawn by playing e5, pawn takes, long castle, because of d takes e5, the bishop diagonal gets blocked by his own pawn, if you try to push the pawn to open up the diagonal for the bishop then it will bring a twister for you, let me show you how, if it happened to target this, then h4, bishop takes, pawn takes pawn and threatening mate in 1, so after rook here, queen h6 check, king slides and bishop e2, threatening to play rook here to target this with the supporting of the queen. So bishop, goes back to his home, rook here anyway, and if you play any normal move queen takes pawn, then I will sacrifice my rook, you have to take it then rook to f1 check, king backs, queen takes, king here and bishop g4 check, the bishops are line up on there so the king can't run over the bishops, so after pawn here, it will be checkmate with the queen and the bishop, Arnish dream will be over to checkmate stockfish, so back to the position, we have knight here to go to the king side, so I block it by playing a3, e4 by him, now the knight is seriously targeted by the bishop, now face h4 fool, targeting this and then this. As I told you at the beginning of the middle game, he takes the pawn, I take back it with my bishop, now I am threatening a savage mate, bishop takes then queen checkmate, ha ha ha, devil smile just like my devil attacks, he played knight here to target it, to removing the queen's line from there, queen g5, knight back to g6 by him, I played d6, sacrificing the another pawn, whenever I sacrifice something you should understand that I have a big plan, that you can't see with your human brain. If you dare to take the pawn, then knight takes, targeting this and threatening to play knight here, to check the king, queen backs, knight check, bishop takes and takes, rook slides away to creating breathing room, bishop d3 to target the knight, so queen here to give a queen exchange offer, so after rook here, if you do queen takes queen, then bishop takes f6, targeting on the knight, so rook here to pressure it, bishop takes knight, pawn takes, rook check, king here, check, the king is trapped into a cell, so. After king here, rook f8, and there is mate in one move, for example, bishop here, 
then bishop checkmate, ha ha ha, and chess friends, if you want to become smart then you can like and subscribe to my youtube channel to get more episodes, back to the position, here we have bishop takes knight, pawn takes, rook here, rook to d6, to target the knight, after pawn takes, there is queen takes check, the king have to go to h8, then bishop check, white will be a double check to the king and it will be mate, so, bishop e6. Try to block the rook's rank from attacking, pawn takes, rook takes e7, queen back to g3, threatening the rook with the bishop, and if you try to save the rook by playing rook to e8, then bishop to f6, threatening rook h8 check, and mate because the knight is paralyzed, because of the queen, she is x-ring the king and knight, so king f8, rook h8, check, knight takes rook, queen to g7, check and mate, game will be over, so back to the position, we have king g7, bishop takes, rook, queen c7, bishop runs to create pressure. Arnish Mittens backs his king, I played bishop f6 trap, threatening rook h8, the knight cannot take it, because of queen g7 checkmate, question mark question mark, it's not checkmate yet, king f8, so face queen g8, checkmate, so here we have bishop g7 to block it, rook h7, queen to c8, queen f4 to give a check, so king slides, queen here, e3 by him, rook check, knight takes, takes and check, because every square is covered by everybody. It is called, checkmate, wish you all the best, thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.